before you sit down, allow me to say this by the Spirit of God. Now, please capture revelation. We are not talking about this day as only today Sunday. No, no. See, when the Bible talks about it, it's Zephaniah chapter number one and chapter number two, two, when it talks about the day of the Lord, it's not a 24 hour kind of a control system or kind of a control day again. My English just told me that you cannot define something by using the same word. But tell me which other, which other word will I use? So when he says the day of the Lord, he's not talking about, you know, a timing in life of 24 hours. No, it's a season, it's a moment, it's an unfolding. Amen. When he talks about the day of the Lord and how the day of the Lord will be, he is not talking about those 24 hours. It will not be 24 hours because by now we understand. Peter tells us that a thousand days before the Lord, a thousand years is like one day, and one day is like a thousand. It's a revelation. So when we say that this is the day that the Lord has made, I'm declaring maybe like we celebrated the birthday for Brian Murphy and we say that the next 10 years of his life are very important. This is where he makes the most important decisions of his life. So we can call those 10 years a day that this is the day that he needs to be very careful. Amen. So when we say that this is the day that the Lord has made, it's not only today, then tomorrow be different. No, we are saying starting from where we are, we have a revelation that we have stepped into the day of the Lord. And everything will work out for our good. Amen. And for the last time, this is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice. I will rejoice. And be glad in it. For some of us, that, that day is 70 years. For some of us, that day is 80 years. It's my lifetime. It's my apportioned stay on this realm of the earth. That becomes that this is my day. And as far as my day is concerned, by the time I close my eyes, the last day of my life, I will look back at my life and I'll be, I have had a good life. Because this is the day, this is the life that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad. You put your hearts together, appreciate the Lord Jesus. Then you may be seated.